Yo, what's going on everyone? It's your boy D. Loy. So yesterday, the Milwaukee Bucks and Brandon Jennings, they have agreed to a multi-year contract. Now, right now, we do not know the exact terms. Hopefully, we can find out that later on in the day. But right now, we do not know the exact terms and the amount of money that Brandon Jennings has signed for. But we do know it's a multi-year contract. And we do know he did play 10 or two, excuse me, 10-day contracts. And he looked very, very good to me. Average five points a game. But he played over 20 minutes in just two of those games. Both of those games, he put up 16 points. One his first game, 16 points, 12 assists. And the one thing you could tell from Brandon Jennings, looking at him now, and then when he last played in the NBA with the Washington Wizards, is Brandon Jennings is playing with a lot more confidence. I think going over to China definitely did help out Brandon Jennings' game and get that confidence back in him. He's one of those players that needs to be confident in himself. And when he goes out there and he has those days where he's hot, he is a very, very good point guard. So I like the fact that he is playing with more confidence. I'm really excited to see what he could do with the Milwaukee Bucks team, especially in the playoffs. We'll see where his minutes are going to be. It looks right now there's probably even amount around 15 minutes per contest. Um, I think that should rise a little bit because he has been playing good, at least in my eye when I watch some of the games. But we'll see what happens. But he has signed a multi-year deal. I don't know if it's fully guaranteed or not. Like I said, we'll learn more about the contract, hopefully, some point today. And I'll let you guys know on Twitter exactly the details of the contract. But he has signed a multi-year deal. He will remain with the Milwaukee Bucks at least throughout the rest of this season and the playoffs. And I should it should be exciting to see him in the playoffs. You know, I think he could definitely be a difference maker, especially in those games where he is putting up. 15 16 maybe 20 points a game coming off of the bench i think that could be a huge help for the milwaukee bucks but you guys let me know how you guys feel about this signing in the comment section below do you think it was a great signing for the milwaukee to lock up brandon jennings for the rest of the year or do you think maybe they were better off with another backup point guard you guys let me know how you guys feel about this in the comment section below it's your boy d lloyd let me see y'all next time peace